Ze je ik voel elkaar. So Teal started to wrap the egg. That's cozy. What's up, Zatil? Hey! Ready to sell me that shirt? Took a bit of work, but I found more Kovar. Wonderful! I can start working on your order right away. Come back later. Good meeting you, Zatil. Stay gold, Cutter Slade. Shamaz Nemet. You return. Can you heal me? Brace yourself. The odds guide my hands. I gotta go now. The odds bless you. You look worried, Greg. What's up? We'll discuss that after our urgent matter. I'll be indiscreet so the kid doesn't hear us. He's way too anxious around the egg, and I don't want him to freak out. So, what's so urgent? A Galenta mother uses her trunk to eat the parasites that develop on the surface of her egg. This phenomenon seems to occur after the shell reaches a certain temperature and releases a very specific type of... Too many details. All you have to know is the egg has parasites and we have no trunk to take care of them. So these bubbles are parasites? I see. Pay attention! I said parasites! If we don't do anything, these filthy organisms will breach the egg before it's time. The baby Galanta won't survive a premature birth. So what can we do about it? <laughs> Your tongue is not long enough, but I appreciate the gesture. Tonha! Tonha could help us, yes! Enough said. Time is of the essence. You can ask Doc where you can find some Tonha, but do not tell him why. The kid already makes me nervous as it is. Do what I say, now! How many Tonhas do you need? Don't be so cheap. One is not enough. As a matter of fact, too few of them would only slow down the propagation, but not stop it. We need a whole pack of Twanhas to save the egg. Where can I find a Twanha? They don't sell Twanhas in Procreana. Ask around! I don't want to keep you. Hey, Doc. How's the egg? Look! Do you see those strange bubbles on it? I can't figure out what they are. You know where I can buy a Twanha? There are no Twanhas in Amiya. We wouldn't interfere with the sweet smell of the village. Hats those orders. You should ask more about that. His network of merchants is larger than mine. But why would you need Twanhas? Is there a problem with the egg? A problem? <laughs> what problem? Ah, it's all good. Trust me. Come see me anytime. What's up, Moore? Find any new climbers? No one as valuable as Doc. Do any Tuan Ha merchants? I need to buy some. Then you are up for quite a journey. There are no Tuan Ha's in Amir or anywhere close for that matter. 
So where can I strike a deal then? Your best chance is the village of Beedham. Kartak is breeding exceptional Tuan Haas there. Heard you can even ride some of them. Which sounds quite sick. Kartak from Beda. Understood. Tell Kartak that more sent you. You'll get the best price. Him and me go way back. Ha. <laughs> I remember once we had so much land here together that... Hmm. Scrap what I just said. Don't tell Kartak anything. Don't mention my name at all. Um... Okay. Thanks, anyway. Thanks, Moore. See you around. Tell Doc he can come back when he runs out of Zorkins. Or Dignity. Whichever comes first. Chief Hatso. That's right. I am the Chief. And I'm ordering you to move your piece of junk! Do you know where I can buy Twanhas? There are no Twanhas in Emiya. You have to travel as far as Beda to find a merchant willing to sell you one. Feel free to go and stay in Beda, please. I wish I could stay longer, but... You have to go? Good. Who's back, Adelpha?
and fluffy. Cool. You picked the wrong target, bird.
You're coming with me, plant. Inhale poison gas and smell better than that plant.
Howdy, cowboy. Not sure what a cow is, mister, but I know bombars, and I'm a bombar boy. Ozak is my name. Hey, Ozak. I'm Cutter Slade. What are you up to? I'm pushing a herd of bombars that way. Then later, I push it back this way. Circle of life. This particular herd of bombars are the most stubborn creatures I ever met. After Scoot. You got a problem with your herd? You can call it a communication breakdown. I tell Scoot what to do, and then Scoot tells the bombars. Otherwise, they don't listen to me. How hard can it be? They're just... bombars. It's always a hustle to herd them back to the pen. Scoot is a good assistant, but I wouldn't say no to a couple of helping hands like yours. Especially with the Garandars lurking on my herd. Less bombars outside of the pen means less Garandars attacking our perimeter. All right. All I have to do is lead them back to the pen, then? It ain't that easy, mister. You'll see. It's better than most places, I guess, but I lost a lot of friends recently to the Garandars. Are you scared of the invaders? Can't be scared of what I've never seen. Lampe put me to sleep one night. They came in, broke the Daoka, and they were out when I woke up. So long, cowboy. Don't know what that is, but y'all bless you, buddy. Yes, you there? I hear you. Is everything all right? You ever had to herd bond bars? <laughs> Females do not concern themselves with the herding of bond bars. They are too busy running the planet. Figured as much. My former navy unit could see me now. They'd have a good laugh. As long as the bond bars stay safe in their pen, the Garondars won't attack. It's important work, Ulokai. Adding this to my resume then. Talk later, Lias.
guy. Gotta love a water mill. Ulakai, having trouble activating Beta's master Daoka? We need it up and running as soon as possible. I'm marking a location on your map. You can see the outpost from the village. The core has to be stashed there. I trust your instincts, Lias. I'll check it out. How's business? I'll take your Zorkins if you want to get rid of them, but I have nothing to sell until that yacht damn Daoka is up and running. Maybe I can do something about it. That would be a blessing from the yachts. I have to go now. Thanks, man. collecting these things. Oh, 
helpful. And oh, so harmful. Getting through this.
New weapon module. Nice. Who calls the shots around here? I am Hiram, Chief of Bida. But you got the wrong information, stranger. We don't drink Lampe in shots. Lampe is best served in a pint cold as the Palana snow. Who are you? I'm Cutter Slade. I was told that your village needs help. How are you guys holding up? A cold drink of Lampe smooths away the rough edges. Things could be worse, things could be better. Spoken like a true politician. What's the village of Bida famous for? What planet did you fall from? Lampe, of course. We have pretty decent Tuan Ha's, too, but they don't drive Bida's economy. How come the other villages don't produce Lampe? Our water is exceptional. You can't make Lampe without exceptional water. Are you guys also selling water? Selling water? You mean in, in a mool? Who would be stupid enough to buy bottled water? You got a point there. But don't discard the idea just yet. It's a potential gold mine. Where are the invaders? Outside town, drilling stations. So the village is safe? Hardly. All the drilling brings the Garondars to the surface towards us. Goddamn creatures never used to roam these lands. Good thing that the village is preserved for some reason. You know why? I'm the mouth that sells, not the brain that overthinks what it cannot influence. Mirko tried to explain it to me over a pint of lampe last night. But hey, I don't think at night. I party. I'm gonna shut down these drilling stations. Any idea of what they're drilling for? If I had ideas yesterday, they're gone today. That's the magic of lampe at play. I can't get a read on you, Chief. You want me to help your village or what? Yes, please help us end the drilling and end the terror of the Garondars so we can start shipping Lampe everywhere again. What's a Garandar? A devouring beast living below us. I figured that much. Any other details you want to share, Chief? Watch your step. When a Garandar surfaces, Bonbars are eaten and Talans revert. About Bonbars. Look, I am in the process of rejuvenating my essence, and words use energy. Talk to Ozak about Bonbars. He's not called a Bonbar boy because of his Tuan Ha. So, seriously, what is Lampe? Lampe is the finest drink in Adelpha. It's the reason I wake up every afternoon. So that makes you an afternoon-only chief? Part-time job? Are you a little wasted right now? No, I am the chief after all. But tonight I will drink and sing. Lampe makes you sing better than the Almayel and sleep sounder than a reverted Talan. You want some? We have discounts for new customers. Are you a chief or a salesman? My role is to sell more Lampe than I consume. 
Bida's economy depends on it. I'm looking to acquire a shipment of Lampe. Lampe, good. Can you help me? I don't deal with the Zorkins. I'm the marketing guy. Talk to Marzo if you want to make a purchase. Later, Chief. Farewell. Flash, I'm not a kid. I'm all grown up. But if you see me as a kid, you probably have a problem with your eyes. Let's test your ears now. The name's Mirko. So, what's my name? Um, Mirko? Bingo! It's just the eyes, then. Now, on with the mandatory speech. Welcome to the brewery. What brings you to Bida? What can you tell me about the invaders? Well, they don't mess with our village, which is a plus. I like being alive and all. But they want something underneath us, in the ground. And their drilling's messing up the Garandar's orientation. Garandars around Bida are the opposite of a plus. What do you know about Garandars? Well, there's the obvious. Huge worms. Extremely dangerous, too. But... And the less obvious part, please. They're like me. They're misunderstood. They're not coming to the surface to eat us. They're just trying to get away from the underground drilling. It's hurting their little worm ears. Well, huge worm ears. Actually, I'm not sure how big their ears are. They haven't attacked the village? No, and I found out why. There's a very small life form in our water supply that's toxic to Garon bars but harmless to you or me. Well, I don't know about you. We should test that later. How did you find that out? Dude, I told you. I'm the only Talan in Bida besides Dorga who went to Procreana University. I've got a brain. Stick around and you might learn a thing or two. <laughs> I only like cocky when I'm the smartest guy in the room. Not liking it now. What are the invaders drilling for? Well, I have a theory, but it's too dangerous for me to even go near the drilling stations to confirm it. So, you know, maybe we'll just never know because this village isn't interested in knowledge. It's interested in Lampe. Do you know what Lampe does to your brain? It's like I'm helping my dad brew an anti-knowledge potion. Say I would be interested in verifying your theory. Should I put my ass on the line and go out there? Your ass? Why? No, I don't want you to put your ass anywhere. But if you're half as curious as I am, you could look inside one of their drill pits and maybe bring me whatever you find. And why would I do that? My theory, dude. I'm smart. I want to do something with my life, but I can't do much with this broom in my hand. If you help me prove it, I promise you'll have something to use against the invaders. You're a fighter. I can tell. So, what's your theory? I don't want to blow your mind quite yet. If you find anything interesting in the drill pits, I would be thrilled to examine it. It's up to you. What are you up to? Well, you see, I should be at Procreana University right now, studying the scrolls, living that canoe life. You know how it goes. But the invaders dropped bombs on my campus, so I'm here, sweeping floors for my dad. That's what you call a major bummer. You're gonna use the Daoka, now that it's back on? The university is closed. Half of the Dano library is burnt to cinders. Where am I gonna go? Besides, 
My father wants me to waste my life away in this boring brewery. I found the last recreator. Not the bravest guy, but he's got skills. What? That's amazing! Does he need an assistant? I don't know. Marzo needs you here, right? Yeah, but I mean... Uh, uh, forget it. Look, when everything's said and done, I'm sure Nurkan will be delighted to have a brain like yours around his workshop. It's just not the right time. Uh, you sound like my dad. The son of a brewer becomes a brewer. Who will teach your son to become a brewer? Blah, blah, blah. I heard it a thousand times. Do you know an old Talan named Kureg? I remember him. He used to work at the Dano Library in Progriana. He's still there. He's got plans to rebuild the Dano Library, but he's missing a lot of scrolls. Oh, wow. Really? I actually have one of his scrolls. Fay Fun Homemade Fireworks Explained. Ooh, the late fees on this must be killer. Can you give this back to him? Don't tell him I took it. See you, Mirko. You know where to find me. Hey, maybe you can help me. I can try. Hey there. Have you come to Torga for healing? I think I need a shamas. I don't feel so good. May the yards heal your wounds. Can you tell me who you are again? Most certainly. I am Torga, Shamaz of Bida. I'm gonna shut down the invaders' bases one by one. Mm. By bases, I figure you mean they're drilling stations. To get to the drilling stations, you need to dodge the Garander, so... Well, good luck with that. Are the invaders giving Bida a hard time? The hardest time? They're the reason why the Garandars have crawled up from the planet's depths and terrorized these lands. If only those giant worms had a taste for metal instead of Talan flesh. If you want to find the invaders, start with their three drilling stations surrounding Bida. Get rid of the drilling, and you should get rid of Bida's Garander problem. 
How would you describe a bond bar? That's a funny question. It reminds me of the fairy tale about this little shamaz that visits a moon and... Well, I, I, I don't remember the details, but at some point someone asks him, Draw me a bond bar. And, uh... Well, uh, yeah, I forget how it ends. Still have the scroll somewhere. Borrowed it from Procriana's library before the invasion. It's called the Little Shamaz. Do you feel safe in Bida? In Bida, yes. Garanders don't attack the village. Outside of Bida is a different story. I suffer from Garandophobia, you know. What's Garandophobia? The fear of being eaten by a Garandar. What makes you think a Garandar is going to eat you? It almost did. I barely escaped with my life. The Garandors can smell my presence. To them, I'm as tasty as a bonbar. Smell your presence, huh? What are you doing? Your clothes. What are they made of? Well, they're weaved from our finest... That's it. I'm wearing bonbar wool. And I sleep in a blanket made from the same wool. Of course they smell me. Garandors eat bonbars like candy. Peace out, Torka. Peace out, peace in. <laughs> peace all around. Nah, no space left. Sticky loot. Awesome.
That's not good. Nice find. You're locked on to me. Oh, worst stench ever. storage. Place. You don't look like you're from around here, so 
I guess my next word should be welcome to Vida. Name's Marzo. You here to drink our planet-renowned lampe? <sighs> Shouldn't drink when I'm on the job. Kicking invader ass takes a bit of focus. Whoa, invader ass, okay. Why'd you come here to kick that? Maybe you want to build your strength first. Hurt some bombards or whatever. Save us from extinction. That's what your yods told me to do. So, I'm guessing that means getting rid of the invaders. One bullet at a time. And that's what I got. Bullets and time. If you're here to start a crusade, friend, I won't stop you. Just keep my boy Mirko out of it. He'd be the first one to sign up, but I, I need him here. How are you dealing with the invaders? Their damn drilling stations are agitating the Garandars. That's a big problem. Hard to get my shipments when the delivery people keep getting eaten or smashed up. I have to keep up with my delivery schedule, but it's getting harder and harder. Tell me about Mirko. My son. Super smart. But he has to work a little bit more on his enthusiasm for the family business. I need that boy here. He wants to study, but there's no school in Beta. You don't have much love for the Garandars, huh? You didn't run into any of those goddamn worms on your way here? Damn. Maybe they don't like you. I should hire you to escort my next shipment. Just how dangerous are they? Compared to what? The neck arc plague? Playing with Bugats to run your crotch? They're as dangerous as danger can be, fool. Garon does are the type of beast you want to keep underground. But those drilling stations make them dizzy, and now they're coming up to the surface eating bonbars, talons, and whatever else they can stuff in their gullets. What's a bonbar? It's this village's main source of meat, and a near endangered species with those Garandars around. You should talk to Ozak. He's the last bombard boy left in Beta. All the others are marinating in some Garandar's belly. You're tough. I like that. I got one batch ready now. Can you help escort it to Sapa? Fella named Zala boarded these barrels of Lampe hundreds of cycles ago, but I can't find anyone brave enough to make the delivery. You got me a brave. I'm your man. Okay, perfect then. Are you ready to go? Yard damn bombards! Always in the way! Come on now! Move away! Scoot, I said! Hey there! You talking to my Twan, huh? No, look! No, I. Look, Ozak! I have an urgent delivery to make. Can you clear the way? I'm trying. But something's getting these bombards real agitated. I can't help you there. It's your job, not mine. Go on. You heard the Talan. Let's move this way. Let the lampe pass. Come on. Not that way. This way. Don't turn around now. Listen to me. Oh, I don't have all moon. Move out of the way. Scoot. <laughs> Can you at least do something to help me here? Ah! Bozak, the stomping! Make it stop now! Uh, I can't! That's what bombards do! How would you ask a... Oh, oh no! Is... is it gone?
Hey, Marzo. About that convoy. You had one job. Protect the convoy, protect the lamp peg. What the Zord happened? The giant worm happened. What am I supposed to do? Have you seen the size of that thing? I don't know what you did, but you managed to attract the Alpha Garandar. It's never been seen around these parts before. Now I gotta start the brewing process from scratch. God damn! I messed up the shipment. I get it. Let me help in some other way. I won't mop the floor or clean the toilets, but... I already got my son doing that. I don't need you messing up his routine. You can help me gather a few ingredients for the next batch. Do that, and we're square. Right. Tell me what you need. Mirko has the list. Talk to him, and he'll give you the details. But bring every ingredient straight to me. They'll probably use them for some science experiment. Mm. I can't afford that. Tell me about Zalab. He's the Shamaz of Sapa. Quite a character. He's got a little group called the Ventilope Club. I hope Zalab understands the delays and will still pay the whole Zorkin's amount. With the current economy, I can't offer a discount. Hey, at least no one got hurt. Oh, I got hurt, friend. That was my biggest shipment this cycle, and the damn Alpha Garandar drank it all! Uh, she didn't even drink it. She spit everything out. And that's the saddest part. The Alpha Garandar, as you call it, ate a crazy amount of bomb bars. Ozak must be mad as hell. We both lost a fortune in that accident. I heard Ozak's Twanha took a hike, too. Poor bomb bar boy. See you next moon. Hey, Chief. I know you. Garandars hate the taste of Lampe. How about that? Good for us. But they discovered the taste of Bonbar meat and love it more and more. Ozak is losing his herd. He should bring that herd back to Beda. Garandars don't surface in the village. I'm busy here. Maybe you can help Ozak. Quit the maybes, you know I can. Sorry about that giant Lampe puddle. I mean, Lampe Lake or whatever. I blame the Alpha Garandar. Have you seen the size of it? Immense! We must defeat this foul and probably very drunk creature, considering the amount of lampe it swallowed. It's good advice. Let's organize a Worm Anonymous meeting as a trap. And as soon as it shows its ugly head, boom! Huh? <laughs> but I digress. Back to lampe. Is there any left? Ask Marzo. He keeps the scrolls in order. Later, Chief. Farewell. Hi there. Mirko, do this. Mirko, do that. Mirko, come here. Mirko... Oh, hey! How are you? I told your dad I'd help with lampe ingredients. You have some kind of list for me? Hmm, let me see. What are we missing? We are running out of Morax. The Tvonha drool levels are pretty low. And we could use more pistols? Where can I find pistols? You can't miss them. Go to the large root on the hill. You have to open its flowers and catch the pistols inside real quick before they close again. This is new. I have to ask about the Tvonha drool. Really? It's the sticky stuff that drips from the dumb animal's mouth. Mm, it's more about how to collect it. <laughs> it's, it's not like you have to use your bare hands. Oh, good. You know, for a second there, I thought... <laughs> use these containers instead. Attach them to the mouth of the Tvonha, and don't come back until it's completely full. Kartak can help you with that. Where can I find more eggs? You can only find more eggs in the village of Emiya. It's a special fruit. Adds a touch of luxury to an otherwise cheap beverage.
See you, Mirko. You know where to find me. Cutter Slade. Good for you. And you are? Oi, oh, I actually didn't understand what you just told me. I'm a merchant. We're supposed to be polite with the clients. Slade is my name. Very nice. I'm Kartak. I raise and sell Twanhas. Mirko gave me these containers to collect the drool of the Twanhas. It's easy. Look. Ugh. Okay. Attack. Have you brought my knee card back? Hmm, I'm not sure. Moore sent me to buy some Twan Haws. That tall Zord owes me a brand new knee card. That's gonna cost you. Look, the animals aren't even for him. I say you throw me your best price, and I'll talk to Moore about his debt. How about that? You're lucky that the Twan Ha business is slow. Take them, but don't you dare come back without a knee card, or you'll get the high season treatment.
Ah, shit, here they come. Assessing. Alien specimen not following. to carry that stuff around.
Assessing. Alien specimen won't follow you off-road. Return to path. Specimen stopped. Return to path. Assessing. Alien specimen stopped. Return to path. It's gonna work. Here we go. Unukai! Look! Kurig was right! You made it! Wow. Someone's hungry. It smells like... A filthy twop, huh? In my beautiful village? They must have lost their mind! Essence, Lias. We Dolotai Guardians are blessed with the Fey Essence. This is the way the Yods have chosen for us. What's yours? Uh, my people don't have those sort of things. Everybody has an Essence. Have you been to the Well of Essence? I did. I don't remember it. It feels like a different life now. Think of it as a new beginning. Yeah, I don't overthink things. I'm more an action kind of guy. That's why the Talans need you, Ulakai. Chief Hatso. That's right. I am the chief, and I'm ordering you to move your piece of junk. Have you examined the egg lately? I checked it, and I heard it. Strange digestion sounds coming from inside. Thank the Yods for those covers, or it would be a perfect Please revert us, Beacon. Doc knows what he's doing. I think. The same Doc who believes he is the mother of this egg? He is a fool who will get us all reverted. Always a pleasure to see you leave. Hey, Doc. How's the egg? Look! Do you see those strange bubbles on it? I can't figure out what they are. Come see me anytime. Meals on the house, Twan Haas. You and I have met before. Another scroll for you, Kureg. Ah, yes. This one will be the centerpiece of our collection. In return, I give you a page of Asio's research. Now, there's more scrolls out there, and I'm not getting any younger. Go! Is it working? Of course I'm working. Good job on the Twanas. They have nimble tongues and seem to enjoy the disinfecting. Now, if you would excuse me, I have to document the process as precisely as possible. You gotta go. Stop saying you are a dollar tie guardian. I don't believe you.
New weapon module. Nice. Hello, Shamaz Nemet. You return. Take care, Nemet. Hello, Shamaz. You return. Can you heal me? Brace your. Take care, Nemet.
I really need to carry that stuff around. Nice find. Just what I need.
those alien plants I have to find. this way. Easy. Let's slice this puppy open. See what's inside. Yeah, easy. Let's slice this puppy open. See what's inside.